live. We're tracking light flurries this midday and temperatures around 30 degrees in Lafayette and the wind speed has picked up to 14 miles per hour out of the west northwest at this hour and will continue to have wind speeds picking up during the afternoon hours. Wind gusts up to 30 miles per hour will be possible. Temperatures area wide sitting in the lower to mid 30s. It is 36 in Kokomo and Atlanta and 31 degrees in Covington. Plus we're tracking more rounds of snow showers, especially moving in this afternoon. It'll become widespread and that's going to last into the overnight hours and even into your Tuesday. We have a few flurries showing up in our western counties on Precision 18 radar also off to our east just east of Delphi. You can see flurries falling just north of Fowler and around Oxford and that's stretching through Warren County and even through Attica. Still staying mainly dry across greater Lafayette but we'll still have a chance for flurries late within the next couple of hours as well. We'll have snow showers getting ready to move into Montgomery County and also moving into the Crawfordsville area at this hour. During the evening commute, we may see difficult travel conditions and that's because we have the chance of seeing snow squalls form during the evening and overnight hours. That may reduce the visibility at times and then we also have the threat of blowing and drifting snow with wind gusts up to 30 miles per hour possible. After school today, temperatures will fall into the upper 20s around 29 degrees by 4 o'clock seeing a chance for scattered snow showers and then we have that chance for breezy conditions as well. Starting up our future cast today at noon, you can see the scattered snow becoming more widespread around 7 o'clock. That is going to last into the overnight hours and also into tomorrow morning's commute, which we may have slick spots on the roadways tomorrow morning with temperatures falling into the lower 20s. We'll drop near 21 degrees in Lafayette, overnight low of 23 degrees in Crawfordsville. Tomorrow afternoon a high of 27 degrees and then the snowfall is expected to continue through your Tuesday as well and then we have the chance for lake effect snow showers mainly affecting our northeastern counties and that is going to remain a threat for our northeastern locations until Wednesday morning and then it is ex expected I should say to move out two to four inches of snow will be likely in our northeastern locations because those are the counties that are more than likely could see lake effect snow showers one to two inches for our southern locations, also the western half of the viewing area. Temperatures will continue to fall as well into the single digits for Tuesday night and into Wednesday night as well. Only a high temperature of 17 degrees on Wednesday. A few flurries will be possible Wednesday morning and then skies will turn mostly cloudy and then partly cloudy for your Thursday. 24 degrees will be the high temperature there and then another system is expected to move in on Friday. That'll bring us another round of snow showers and then cooler temperatures for the weekend. So by the time this is all said and